sunny side, the absolutely gorgeous JRPG farm sim that we've covered here in the channel before is finally playable via a demo on Steam. But for me, the most exciting part is that I can finally share it with you guys. And not only do I have some gameplay to share, but as you might have noticed by this incredibly long video, it's a bit of a different one than my usual. I was kindly joined during a four hour play session of the game by the studio's owner and lead developer who hung out with me in voice chat the entire time, answering questions, adding in fun facts, and shedding light on some aspects of the game that you won't ever see just by playing through it yourself. So with that said, here's a little over an hour of highlights from that play session. I hope you enjoy, cause I sure know I did. <laughs> What's going on, everybody? I'm super excited. I got access to a playtest version of Sunnyside, and we're about to dig in. We have both the, well, not both, two of the dev team with us today, if you want to say hi. Hello. Hi, hello, Fem. Hello. How are you? And that's Rainy. Fem's the female voice. Hi. Rainy's the male voice. How are you guys doing? Good. Excited. While I create a character, do you guys want to talk about what Sunnyside is? Oh, we have modes now. <gasps> That's new. <laughs> Preferred Actually, game mode. No. So I JRPG just and farm reactions. sim. Okay. So I know That's JRPG it. farm sim is the rough explanation of how this game operates. And I'm guessing this is our option to do cozy, which is more the farm sim mode, you know, or RPG mode, which is more JRPG with farm sim aspects as well. I guess I could read these. That might help. Game economy sent to normal. Yeah. Battles are simple, easier, and less frequent. That's going to be in the mines. Uh, XP gain rate set to normal. Rare item drop is increased. Crop and resource harvest quantity is increased as well. Interesting. Okay, so that's, I don't want to say easy mode, but cozy, casual. Um, RPG mode, game economy has increased difficulty. Battles are complex, challenging, and more frequent. XP gain is slower. Item drop rate set to normal for rare items. Crop and resource quantity is set to normal. I feel like RPG mode is the the standard way to play, but like- Not really. No? It, it really, no, it, and that was something we wanted to like stay away from, is we didn't want it to feel like there was the normal mode and then oh, here's the easy version. Ah. It's really just divided in, this is more if you want a relaxed experience, this is if you want a more challenging experience, and whichever one you choose, the okay. numbers do get altered in some way. I like the custom. Cool, yeah. I like all things about RPG, except for the game economy being easier or like or sorry i like hold on cozy is normal rpg <laughs> is increased I, I think regular money making is good with me everything else i like the rpg aspect what i will say is this version because this is a play test version it's a little bit more sped up so the okay. xp gain is actually way faster than it will be in Got any it. of the modes because okay we people to well that's to fine stuff. we'll get to experience more of the game never a bad thing <laughs> I have played this a little bit before, but things look different now. Just a little. Just a bit. My first... Oh, that's... You've got the bird, but not the... Oh, okay. We're going to shift over here for a little bit. Look at us. <laughs> that's beautiful. Okay. Good. Let's move forward. Okay, join Squirrel today. This is our name. So we'll go with Doc and D Dub. They can call us whatever they want. And we get to create a username too for how we show up in the social media app, which is Squirrel. We'll just go back to D Dub. We can add a bio. And we can take a fall. <laughs> This feels way too real. We're taking a selfie in the, looks like a coffee shop. We got coffee and pastry options. There's someone working on their laptop over there with a zero bezel lap. Oh, this is so nice. A little station to prep your coffee. Oh, this is so cool. 
We'll get some other people. Actually, let's get that in the background because not sure what that means, but I'm assuming the circle will be exactly what shows in white. Then, hey, there it is. And our phone is incredibly broken. I'm just now seeing that. Is that the introduction to? I won't get ahead of myself. I think it is. <laughs> it is. Add a bio. Uh, adding a bio so you can see what a bio looks like in in this lovely social media app. Totally not a game. Dot dot dot. Cool. Farmer to be is our occupation. Our birthday is the zeroth of spring. Sweet. Gender identity. Okay, so can I give my understanding of how the system works real quick yeah. and you can correct me yeah. as needed? Yeah. So you have the scale from female to masculine and it looks like you've narrowed the range. It's now a two number range. So basically you can either be hyper masculine, hyper feminine or anywhere in between. Every NPC that is romanceable has a, a spectrum on which they find people attractive. Like myself, I'm a straight male. I can find someone super feminine or like somewhat feminine equally attractive so their range or that range in my case would be on the 10 to maybe four scale if i fall anywhere in between that like two to four or three to five or four to six or all the way female that person would be attracted to to me so while you are specifying your preference everyone has a certain range on which they find attractive so they may or may not be into you is that fairly accurate that's pretty accurate yeah so it's um you choose a three point spread and then, Zero, one, or uh, two. Okay. Yeah. And then they, each NPC has, like you said, a range of what they like. And each section of their range has a number assigned to it, anywhere from okay. one to three. So ah, so they love, if, love you, or they kind of like you. Exactly. So if you only overlap with them just a little bit, you might only gonna be get real a hard. one modifier. It'll Got be a little it. bit difficult. It's possible, but it's harder. So if but I give someone an egg, a, three. Yeah. So if I do the traditional farm sim thing, give someone a single egg every single day, maybe capped it two a week, I can either have it happen or like get to the next romance checkpoint, whatever, three times as fast if I'm there in their target range, or one times as fast, or not at all if they're not at all into me. Partially, except it's not connected to gifting in any way. Okay. Cool. Uh, my strategy, and yes, I'm using a strategy, <laughs> is to go slightly less of fully masculine, because anyone that likes super masculine probably likes a little bit less than that. That's my gameplay Good aspect strat. of this. So, Good strategizing strat. my masculinity. I don't think I've used those words before. <gasps> look at those! They look delicious. By the way, the music in this game, so right. freaking good. We're setting up at the coffee shop. Well, I'm here for you, no matter what happens. Thanks, sis. Or uh, bro, I don't know. Akira. Hey, what are big sips for? Let me know how it goes. I will. Cool. Oh, look at those socks that we so expertly picked out the color of. Oh my gosh, this is so cool. This is so much better than the opening from before. Just FYI. <laughs> yeah, I agree. <laughs> so we get dropped off. Our first stop is a coffee shop. Oh my gosh, you guys killed it with this city. <laughs> Which is visitable, it's honestly, by the way. all rainy. Rainy made it. I Good job, can't rainy. take any credit for the city. By the way, rainy is still Thank in the you. background. <laughs> there he is. I am here. I am watching <laughs> quietly and enjoying. Uh, yeah? Occasionally. There's the bus. This is so cool. I'm excited. I still remember the first time he uh, did an acoustic version of a song. Everyone was asking if they could marry him. Like, no, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> He's happily married. Ooh, we get to watch the bus ride in. Sunnyside, Maine. And you can see Higashi, the city in the background. Squirrel. I don't see what that says other than join today, but my gosh, this opener is so much better. We're about to see the. Is it going to be like sunny? Su <laughs> <laughs> yes, it is. And I like the it's not a gradient sunny inside different colors. Beautiful. And a little fox. 
And a not so little cow. Water wheels are new. And the water. Mm. Oh my gosh. This is a beautiful just like hype up for the game right here. Just watching all the things you'll get to explore. I'm curious, is this like dynamic in that like I just saw an NPC yes. walking across the street. Sometimes yes. they might not be in that shot. Yes. Okay. New song unlocked. New song can be purchased from Higashi Record Store. All right, everyone. Starting price is 350 cupules. Cup cupules? 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 It's a real word, I swear. Based on what? Uh, that is what you call the top of an acorn. You're right. I remember that conversation once upon a time. It's yep. yeah. 900 to my friend in the back as we wave. <laughs> Go us. Anyone for 950? 900 going once, going twice. Sold for 900 cupules. See hero to finalize your property deed. Thank you, everyone. Yeah. Hey, congrats. Name's Gabriel. <laughs> What, you like the voice? <laughs> Mayumi says I'm supposed to give you a ride to your new place once you've settled up uh, the taxes and paperwork. Oh, all right. I'll wait here. Come find me when you're ready to go. Hello, congratulations. If you'll just sign these documents, please. Ah, so we can't understand any of this except for farm name? That's cool. Is this authentic? Partially. Partially. So the form itself is an actual property deed form that we found online from Japan, like legal. Stuff. Nice. There's a lot. Of, there's a lot of research, but um, it says nothing in Japanese. Got it. <laughs> um, so if you do speak Japanese, it's it's all garbage. Um, and then the symbol we made. So sunny side is a type of an egg. So we're gonna go for what do we want to do? Scrambled or. <laughs> Over easy farm. Does it add the word farm afterwards? It does not. Nope. So if we want to be over easy farm, you gotta say it. Yep. We have to add it. Mm -hmm. Cool. Over easy farm. Uh, F for phone. Koi beats. That's awesome. <laughs> we can change the music at any time. <laughs> Hold on. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Sorry, I had to put on the right beats to check out this journal. Oh, and it's full screen too. That's nice. Holy, okay, so we've got New Year's Day. You can't click on it to see it, but if you hover over it, we have a farmer's market on the 7th and 21st. And then we have Valentine's on the 14th and Oak Tree Day on the 28th with Cherry Blossom Day two days prior and a town birthday. The town's birthday? Yeah, so there's a... Uh, With the anniversary big, of its establishment? That's cool. Yeah, there's a big thing in Japan. It's called Golden Week. And it's the week between spring and summer. And it's a week long. And it's like a bunch of holidays all back to back. So we wanted something similar to that. So we gave you three days of events in the spring. Heck yeah. This is cool. We've got journal and achievements. Holy, hold on. How many are there to start? These icons are fantastic. They're amazing. Our artist Liz did them and she knocked it out. Liz is amazing. Okay, okay amazing. some of these, all of these can be displayed on backpack. So let me guess. These are all backpack charms and They're you like unlock buttons. them. Little, oh, okay. Mm -hmm. That's cool. Form a serious romantic relationship. Click five plushy Chan. <laughs> Use the cheese kettle 30 times, catch a fish, rescue a pet. We won't go into pets quite yet. Camera app. We're in selfie mode. We can switch the front and reverse camera. Look at the architecture. It's so, it's so yeah, nice. That's all Ken. Ken did a great job. We actually, this building's really cool. We found a real building in Japan that is a heron sanctuary, I think. And we like took pictures of the inside of it on Google Earth 
and like the outside and then we modeled the whole thing after that building that's awesome and the fact that there's a light Duck. you could turn your flash on or not you should mm -hmm. you should try pressing uh, a or d i was gonna suggest that yeah currently and they do nothing ws as well yeah so yeah, turn the camera the WMS. There you oh go. you can change facial expression oh that's neat sorry uh switch camera okay so bottom left <laughs> corner we've got so your face now hit w and then do a and d filters <laughs> Make yeah, the background. I'm going to just for to please the people, you know. <laughs> uh, photos, Gabe. There okay, so this is applied wallpaper. You can cycle through photos, you can delete them, you can go back. And now that it's our wallpaper, is there a way to go out of an app? Yeah, how do you do it on your phone? love it <laughs> cool now gabe is our background <laughs> thanks gabe good modeling okay let's actually talk to gabe now you ready then yes i did just take a photo of you and make you my background cool that's cool over easy farm wow hold on let's check out our tent first oh this is exciting we have until lunch get the phone fixed the tech hero wait for the text from gabe you can't go in it. You can always sleep. Wow. This is cool. It's so overgrown. It's ridiculous. I don't think I've seen this when it's been overgrown. It's always been cleared yeah, from no, like day that's one. That's new. That's new from the alpha. I like it. I've had the option of playing some early test. <gasps> Exploration. Some early test versions like playtest stuff but i've been busy every single time during your <laughs> windows of playing like out of state or just not having access to my computer or something so i haven't played since what the alpha and things think look so, different yeah. and better <laughs> different mean, and what, better what two years worth of work i think mm -hmm. yeah it's been a minute it's several of them <laughs> okay oh that's sweet your inventory is in your actual backpack and you go and look at your in your sack to find what's in your bag yeah, Beautiful. that was Rainy's idea, and it looks great. I love it. Different items that will house items within them. Your bento box yep. for your food, your harvest basket for crops, tackle box for fishing bait, fishing basket for fish themselves, battle pack for the combat system within the mines, which I'm excited to get into. Ah, we go into our bag and we assign tools. And they remove them from your inventory. That's lovely. You're welcome. Thank you. <laughs> Oh, this is fun. We need food, apparently, though. Because our stamina is draining rapidly. I'm assuming that's day one, like, novice farmer. Hold uh, on. Actually, yeah, yeah, yeah. There are skills to upgrade that, yeah. I was going to say, we were walking around, and we got a plus one exploration. Mm hmm Is that visible? Not yet. In we here. We did realize that we do need to give you access to like what skills you have on the phone, but that's coming. Phone decoration? Are these are like notification? Yep. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> and this is just your sample button and then you can click on the left, I assume. That's fun. I don't know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. I've that one, never that one was selected, it. and that's what it was doing. So yeah. now we've got... Oh, that's so fun. Okay. <laughs> Just the grilled veggies. I don't eat meat. You have the option to be a vegetarian or vegan. Yeah, you want. Can we tell people about it if we're vegan? No. <laughs> Is that not an option? <laughs> eat the burger. No, it's not an option. Okay, the grid has been enabled, and you can see where we're allowed to use this. That lovely white border. If you grab the hose, it'll show you its range. But now that they're in our inventory, we plant a potato. Plant the potato. Why I did four, I'm not quite sure. And then we'll grab our hose. Ah, the white circular boundary. So is that as far as the hose can be run to? Yes. Yes. Okay. But we could still like water if we had yeah, crops on the other side. Yeah, shoot outside of it. Yep. 
I really got to clear more of this. Nice. It passes through trees. So you don't have to worry about that. <laughs> it will get stuck on some stuff. <laughs> I see that. Oh, well, we'll retract it later for now. Oh, oh okay. Yeah, you, you just got to jiggle it. This is where aim mode comes in. Yep. Cool. Water icon's gone. We release it with T. And it should auto retract. Cool. Uh, get your phone fixed. Wait for Starburst Seeds. Attend your booth at the farmer's market on Sunday. That's lovely. Also, I don't know if anyone's noticed this. I'm really just not paying attention to it. As long as you have food in your belly, your stamina bar refills itself. Correct. So we were burning through stamina, cutting down that bamboo earlier. But as long as you have food on you and stay well fed, like it's increasing almost just as fast as we're using it. Like you can see it ticking up. I love how smooth the running is. Like if you turn your character, like actually makes kind of a wide loop instead of just, it's not immediate. Like you have to take the time to turn yeah. directions. It feels like you're leaning into the turn. It's kind of cool. Look at that map. I'm assuming that giant bar is where I'm at. Yeah. That's hard to miss. <laughs> cool. Player farm. Ooh, we can get a preview at what this building looks like. It's covered. That's all I can really tell. It's covered. <laughs> has some neat architecture. The level of detail is amazing. Right under my face, we have no unread messages, and we have our current cell signal. We have four <laughs> out of five bars currently. And if we go into a cave, which we'll not do tonight, I'm pretty sure it drops because you're in a cave, which makes perfect sense. Wow. Oh my gosh, there's buildings that didn't exist before. This is a post office. Which I can access at any time of the day. Oh, this is so cool. We got magazines and stuff. Post office. I like the little uh, Z's coming from the <laughs> register, letting me know that it's probably asleep or closed. We could totally mess with the mail, though. <laughs> very secure <laughs> yeah <laughs> uh it's almost midnight ish it's almost what actually no it's only what 10 15 11 15 9 15 9 15 i'm good at reading a 24 hour clock can you tell there will be an option to change it to a 12 hour clock there we go <gasps> we have particle effects now cherry blossom leaves falling oh it's so pretty bravo good job Go devs. That's great. That's that all rainy. Good job, Rainy. We love to see it. A glimpse at what we'll be using to power our farm later. Solar power. Water pumps to extract water from the ground to then stockpile the water wells or silos, whatever they're called, water tanks. Which I think if we look at it as we water our crops, that level just drops a little bit by little bit. It will, yeah. Oh, this is so pretty. Look at the sky, too. Got Aurora Borealis going on. You said there will be a way to look at our skills eventually? Yeah. Ah, is that... Oh. There is a way now. You haven't gotten to it yet in the story. Yes, it has something to do with add... a particular... Uh, yeah. One of these, yes? Yeah. There was a glimpse at it. we will add it. it to, like, the phone at some point. Got it. This is so cool. Hold on, let's look at the, the thing we're here for first. <laughs> that. It's our skill tree. And this is the shrine itself. Oh yeah. Wait, 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 go back. Vending machines? Yep. You can shop at the vending machines. <laughs> I knew you'd like that. Doriaki picky sticks? Is that like, uh, what is it, pokey? Hawk? Pocky, I think. Uh, you said Similar? it, Tommy. <laughs> ah, it's copyrighted, got it. so. <laughs> yes. It's totally not that. Canned coffee. Canned vanilla coffee. Vanilla ice cream. Vanilla chocolate ice cream. Plain onigiri. Salmon onigiri. Mochi. Mochi or mo mo mochi? Mo mochi. Mochi? Mochi. Cheese sandwich. Yum. Not grilled. Just cheese and bread. Fruit sandwich. Melon pan. 
and balanced beer. This beer has a balanced, refreshing flavor. And it shows the price of everything. And I'm not going to do this, but it's, it works very beautifully. It's itemized. And if you add it more than once, it increases the quantity. Or you can go over here to the quantity and just change it around here. Or you can remove it from your cart. And then when you're done, you show shows how much you have, your total. And you can purchase it. Beautiful. You know what? Let's actually get some food. I highly recommend the coffee. We'll, we'll need it. The canned coffee? Yeah. We'll get five canned coffee. We'll get ten canned coffee. And a vanilla coffee, because we're feeling <laughs> extra. Beautiful. And now if we check our inventory, it's going to end up in our bento box, because it's food related. And I'm assuming not only your inventory or your backpack is upgradable, but all of these Actually, are no. upgradable? No upgrades. No upgrades. None. Nope. You so you can have six everything. different food items on you at any time. So forever. all the little circles down at the bottom, there's actually more. Yeah. It's just you don't have anything right now. But as you get more stuff, that whole thing will fill up. So it's oh. actually six times four. But it's only showing me one through six until I have at least six. Then it will show me access to yeah, seven through 12 like as well. Your, that'll be like your hot bar. Ah, and then it looks like it can scroll through hot bars by holding alt to cycle through them and then within it by using the that's nice that's really cool so i can just cycle to my bento box get back over to my coffee and have a little late night brewski it's not a brewski it's coffee you know but all right i'm gonna get off of that because it's giving me the option to consume I'm also stuff i'm gonna point out that on the first day the timer does stop at 9 15. all right bedtime it is so like we wanted people to have the option to just explore on the first day if they want to that's kind of cool feeling rushed so the only thing you can really do is chop down grass so like it's not yeah it's not really game breaking it's not giving you anything yet you can and go you and like make... collect all of the berries you want but who cares so you have more food like whatever i love how as you hear new game music it gets added to your koi beats so you can play it later kind of so it unlocks the option to buy it at the record store so oh if you add okay it to your koi beats you still have to go buy it that's cool this is the song that i feel like is trying to get you like it's it's sexy time music like <laughs> it's it's seductive it's ear candy for the nighttime it's a sleepy time song mm. It's just so good. Oh, beautiful. There was even a little, it looked like a mesh in front of the window. Yeah. This is fun. <laughs> this is very fun. All right, back up to the top we go. Sunny seed. Okay. <laughs> I don't even know where to go. <laughs> My face is in the way. Sunny seed company. Quality seeds delivered to your door. There's a filter to sort by... Oh my gosh. Okay. So instead of fruit, vegetable, and like what? Tree. We have allium, berry, br brassica, flower, fruit, gourd, grains, greens, herbs, legumes, nuts, peppers, roots, spices, tea, and trees. Holy... And there's like a skill level associated with these. Yep. Ah, my face is covering it. It was intentional. Try Royal. Sunny Seed Royal. Highest quality seeds delivered to your door for free. Sunny Seed Royal is a program to give extra appreciation to some of our most devout customers. You are not eligible for Royal. You need to spend 1,000 more cupules to join Royal. The royalty program? Okay. Why not try our daikon seed? Oh my gosh, this is cool. Yeah, this is all, you know, same-ish, but yes, it's definitely been upgraded. This is cool. Display in-season items only. That's a nice toggle. Holy. Okay, this is just for spring. Multiply this by six per row. We've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 
So what is that? 72 different things that can be planted in spring alone. That's, now, given uh, some of those will yes, overlap right. with other seasons, yeah. but still, if you wanted to have 113 all... crops in total. Yep. <sighs> Where does one start? Okay, all these novice. Okay, what makes it novice? Okay, so we can click on it and we get a picture of what it looks like. We can add it to our cart and it'll show how much it's going to cost to add us to our cart. We can also see underneath my face here how much we're currently holding. So what's in our, our wallet. Um, basil, it goes in a small plot. So a one by one. I'm assuming small, medium, large. Actually, no. Small, large, and patties. Oh, for like rice and stuff? Yep. <gasps> small, large, and your friend patty. Lovely. So, <laughs> this hardy and easy to grow basil has large leaves that make it easy to pick. Valued for its anti-inflammatory properties, the fragrance and uh, and flavor. And, yeah, I can't read. The flavor. Yeah, yeah. You guys can read. That's what it says. It's superb. It's superb. Oh, got it. So the seasons on the left. Whether or not we can buy it, yep. it's only be available to be purchased through the Sunny Seed app in spring and summer. Yep. Is that correct? Yep. Whether it can be grown so basil works in spring, summer, and autumn. That's Correct. nice. And then we whether or not it's considered a fruit. Does it's that like mean whether it's, it's fruiting period? Edible? So it's when it's gonna put out things that you can pick. Ah, got it. So we can grow it, like we can plant it as a seed and it'll mature, even if we can't harvest it yet, during spring, yep. summer, and autumn, and it bears fruit. Okay, so this might be more applicable to, I'm going to pick the obvious example, an apple tree. It can grow yeah. in spring, summer, fall, but it can only be harvested in fall. Correct. Herbs not, ex not the best example. Yeah, okay. That and makes sense. And then that last column is actually going to get updated. It, Vitality. We, we came up with a better term since then, and the, the icon is going to change. But that's actually what season the plant will die during. So there are some plants that will oh. die in certain seasons, and so that'll tell you what season it's going to expire. And then ah. you'll see on the right, there's a whole bunch more information, and you'll see the annuals versus the perennials on there. And actually, this one's marked wrong because basil's a perennial, so we'll have to fix that. But okay. So the annuals have a death season, the perennials don't. Ah, so perennial would have the dashes all throughout this, basically. Yep. Yep. That is cool. Annual meaning you plant it once and it will die eventually, not necessarily at the end of the season, but at the Correct. end of whatever season it normally dies. And this is yep. all based on real world crop yep. data. Like this as is how basil works. Get. Yeah, as close as we could get. Because a gamified, still fun version of reality. Correct. Yeah. yeah. Because it's... we have only the seasons were only a month instead of three months, so we had to like tweak yeah. some things. Yeah. But, yeah. Okay, that makes sense. Whether it's one or two or th all three months of that season, yeah. you had to make a a guess or just assign it exactly. something yeah uh days till first harvest six days so if we plant it now we can get a harvest every that's data that's not available so uh days till yeah, first harvest is six often, yeah but it, once it's grown tells you how often it regrows though okay you just gotta figure it out okay i see the wiki becoming a thing for this game oh, for that yeah. for that value Oh my gosh, there's even different photos of it. So we can get baby baby basil and ready to harvest basil, I'm assuming. Yeah. What makes this master versus novice? Like, what's that? Are my arbitrary decisions, honestly. So oh. as you go through your skill tree, you're going to unlock the ability to plant harder plants. And so I went with like real world data. What are some plants that are just notoriously more difficult? So oh. roses tend to be a little bit harder. So the idea is, is that as you get better as a farmer, you're going to feel more confident trying new plants, and then you're going to kind of expand. So without that skill tree, so let's say it's unlocked, but I don't have the points to plant. If I don't have any points in beginner, what does that look no, like? Can I not plant just, them, or are they just like... No. Um, let me think. Can I not buy them? Can I not plant them? Are they just... Do they take more you water? Can buy do they die quicker if want. I don't water them? Like... You can buy whatever you want. When you go to plant it, it'll say that you don't know how to like do this. Ah, okay. 
So it, you get the restriction is implied the second I yeah. try to plant it in the ground. Yep. And it's just a skill based thing. I put in points yep. based on whatever I Actually, earn. Actually, no. There's no no. As far as I know, there aren't any points. I unlock I a certain think... branch of said tree. I don't even think it's that. I think it's just as you get the skill level, as you do more farming, you're going to get the skill naturally, and then you're just going to get more access. Oh, so it's kind of like a skill tree, but the points you're earning are automatically spent in a set progression. Sort of. If you, once we if get you want to think of it tree, like that, that might not be actually how it works, but... Yeah, once you get to the skill tree, you'll see there are things that you can unlock with, like... Well, they're, we'll say they're skill points. It's not, but we'll just say that for now. Um, and it's like things that like make certain things grow faster or it tells you like what growth stage it's on. So there's different like little skills that you can unlock, but the actual progression of being able to buy seeds and plant them is just kind of natural. This is cool. I'm getting a couple extra seeds. Peppermint? That's a perennial. So mm -hmm. it, oh, that will go and live forever. Oh, just my, this is a pro tip. Just buy one. Of everything? Yeah, because go, so go look at it. Like one of the plants, the pages you were on. Do you see there's a little thing that says seeds per pack? Per pack? Oh, you're buying. Oh my gosh. Uh, so unless so, you want like a hundred so seeds, I would just buy one. <laughs> so it's like, it's like the old school Harvest Moon games where you buy a seed and it's actually nine and you sprinkle the bag of seeds that you purchased all around you. Same actually, concept. Actually, no. You're buying a. Nope. You'll see. You'll see. I'll, we'll, we'll show you. Hold on. We're going to take all four <laughs> of these down. Potatoes, though, right? So per it's pack, actually five a to bag ten. of, like, seed potatoes. Because that is a thing. If you actually buy a bag of, like, I want to grow potatoes, you can go and buy bags of seed potatoes. And they're okay. specifically for, like, growing that variety of potato. Okay, well, and seeing so as I was five to here. ten, and I'm probably gonna plant even numbers of stuff or four or whatever, you're gonna need storage for all of this stuff. So we'll build some of that soon too. Okay, that's probably good for now. I could get into more, but like, I could spend forever going through this shop. <laughs> and let's do one almond tree. Why not? Let's get a tree going on a large plot. What is something that takes I a would suggest patty? lemon. Oh, you can't do rice yet because it's a summer crop. Got it. I just wanted to look at it. Oh yeah, it's uh, down a little bit. Uh, oh yeah, unmark that. Oh, you there's a search, search bar. Too, yeah. Oh, I'm just now seeing that. There's different types of rice. Oh, it needs a patty, which is the large one. Oh my gosh, Wait, delivery. Sign on there. Deliveries. <laughs> Same day delivery is expedited. Orders uh, receive all your items within an hour. As long as you place the order before six. So I can place it as late as 5.59 and I'll get it within an hour. Yep. That's awesome. Next day, which is standard, I guess, is 25 or you can do economy. We'll do next day. That's really cool. So if I don't care or if I'm planning for summer and I can be smart yep. about what I want to plant, I can do the economy and do it five days before. But if I'm like, oh crap, I forgot to. Same day is an option. That is so cool. And you can't do it if it's going to cost you too much. Yeah. There's a voucher. <laughs> Enter your 10 digit voucher code below. Is that a mechanic in game? People will give us vouchers uh, and stuff. Kind of. Not really. It's actually more of a promo thing for us. Oh, yeah. That's fun. So uh, you could tweet out the first Yep. I don't know. 100 people that use this code will get it. <laughs> That's really cool. Okay. What's uh, great is that they're not one time use, so we could actually just put out one voucher and anybody can use it. Fun. Yeah. Do you have any vouchers? <laughs> That's a question for Rainy. No, I'm good. I think he just dipped out. I'm good. Uh, okay. Purchase. Your order is on the way. This is so freaking cool. And we're still gonna make some tweaks to it. We're, we keep fiddling with it. We just keep getting better, you know? Oh, this is lovely. And I'm assuming it'll get delivered over by my boxes over yep. there. Uh, okay, so we have some new apps. The journal is, we've seen this plenty. 
Uh, photos, tutorials, settings. Sunny Seed, we've seen the weather app. Today's forecast. Morning, clear skies. Evening, partly cloudy. So we have two options like per day, morning and afternoon or evening, yeah. sorry. And we have the next one, two, three, four, five, six days. So we get a one week's forecast. Is it safe to assume that this won't change like the actual weather forecast does in real life? Correct. Like if it says on it's, it's set. a week out, on Monday the 8th, yeah. it will be sunny with some clouds yeah. and cloudy and in the it's evening. Not, it's not randomized either. It's curated. So it won't, like it, it is what it is. It's not even gonna change. So, so like, if I've played the, this game 30 times on the Saturday yeah. the 6th, it will be raining in the evening. In your first year. It changes per year? Yeah. That's cool. <laughs> I think I did maybe six or seven years. Dang. And then after that, does it I cycle back out. to year one? Yeah. Or do you just not get weather? <laughs> no weather. No, no more weather. This is lovely. We have a to-do list. So currently we have the build station for our drone of a laptop. We can pin it to the screen. And then when we're not in the phone, my face is in front of it. <laughs> we get a lovely build station laptop. Zero out of one completed. It's lovely. Okay, what else is in our utilities? Electricity, stored, demand, nice water. Stored and demand. Okay, and then what's the last new app we got? The drone. You guys got rid of the uh, the drone blades? Yeah, they were a little sickening. For some, yes. Yeah. They're kind of there, but like- Out of range. But I think if I remember right, you can toggle your view. So if you go back in range and then hit C. I yeah, did. It your view. Yeah. Oh, that's so cool. That was our compromise. You can you get stuck in the trees? I'm gonna guess no. I don't think so, no. Probably for the best. That'd be so yeah. infuriating. <laughs> It'd be really annoying. Okay, so. Uh, a shift in space for elevation. Signal strength in the top there. So we can only far, fly so far away. Yeah. Stays pretty strong pretty much anywhere you're at on the farm. Not yeah, totally. You'd have to move range. and launch it from elsewhere. Yeah. And then we have a light. Aha! That's fun. Okay. I've used this song in so many videos. I love it. <laughs> oh, this is pretty. This is gorgeous. I'm stuck on something. Flowers, are you? Yes, okay. Probably. This is lovely. I think Liz did all this. Good job, Liz. Loving it. What is that? It looks like a giant honeycomb. Like the thing you stick in a jar of honey to like get it out? Yeah. Oh man. Learning the map is gonna be fun. By fun, Ooh, I mean it's gonna take some time. Naka. It's too late. Philip's already closed, so you might as well go explore. Uh where's Naka? Behind you. Let me find it! <laughs> Naka! Let me use a waypoint because it doesn't have a waypoint on it right now. There you go. Available activities. We can get coffee, dinner, or have a romantic dinner, but it's closed for lunch. Oh, it's Naka. Let's, uh. I want you to see it at night. Let's not Naka on the door and enter. <laughs> oh, it's. It's beautiful. No one's here. Oh, there goes that impregnating music again. <laughs> we can go outside on the patio. This is so, like, detailed. Oh, hang a right. And go through that that little gate. That? In front okay. Of you on the right. Hi, Blake. I just made the sunny side. Oh, cool. Welcome to town. Oh, Blake. Nice to meet you, Blake. 
Sunnyside isn't like the most exciting place, but I'm sure you like it here. I hope so. Are you nervous? A bit. I get it. Moving to a new town is scary. Trust me, I know. There's not that much to see around here, but if you ever need a tour, hit me up. Thanks, Blake. That's so nice of you. It's no biggie. I'll see you around, dog. She seems like one of the, the youngins. Wait, this, this gate? Yep. I saw the fire from outside. <gasps> you can sit or stand on the nothing. I don't know what that's about. Now, don't touch the mouse. Just leave it. You heard her. Is it not engaging? Oh, it engaged. Ooh. We call these Zen points. That's that's cozy. Does time pass while you're here? I don't know. That's a rainy question. Oh, what's up? <laughs> I got company. And then if you want to get out Hi. of your mouse again. That is so nice. And you don't even have to press E to unsit. You can just use a direction key and move. I have to jump to get out of it. There you go. Yeah. The collision's a bit weird on that one. Yeah, it's a lovely game with a little layer of jank. Like, it's expected. It'll get polished. We're working on it. Yeah. We're working on it. What's up, Sebastian? The Lady Slayer? How's it going? <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to Cafe Naka. What can I get you? He looks like he's trying to... Mm, that pencil? <laughs> I remember that getting shared on a dev stream and everyone was like, Oh my god, I'm gonna <laughs> romance him! I'm blocking his face, oh. let's not do that. Uh, see the little uh, red arrow on the bottom? I do. Yeah, yeah. so that'll be your... your Ooh! You build a... You lay a blueprint down for that new thing. So pretend this is like a... A, a lumber shop. And I place a building blueprint down. I open this up and it shows me I need 12 hardwood planks and four nails and six whatever else. And then you buy that based on your list so you know what you need to buy. Eventually it'll work for recipes too. So you can pin a recipe and then you can see what Ah, you so I can buy raw ingredients from different stores? Like yep. flour and eggs and whatever else you can buy at this store? Yep. Fancy. We've got different kinds of tea. Oh my gosh. So, how long did it take to make all the descriptions for everything? Good oh my gracious. God, so long. You know what actually took longer was researching all the different types of tea. I bet. To know, like, what's <laughs> needed to make them. And... Yep. Oh my gosh. This is so cool. And we can buy recipes. Yep. A cheddar slice. Oh, that's so cool. And then you can unlock more through the skill tree. Oh, so many different categories. So if I want sweet, I can get lemonade. Or if I want a drink, I can also get lemonade. Brine and simple syrup. Oh my gosh. We have 4, 8, 12, 16, <laughs> 20 different types of tea. <laughs> That's not even all of them. I bet. That's just the ones you can buy here. That's insanity. The ones you can make. There are others you can only buy. Wow. And baked goods. Ooh! And this is only... Oh my gosh, that's... <laughs> Hold on, where's the teas? Okay, I said 20 that I can currently buy. That's 4, 8, 12, 16, 20, 24... And that's just the ones I can make, you said, right? So there's 30 yep. teas I can make plus more that you can't. And I think there's a couple more you can only buy. Oh my gosh. Yeah, baking is a skill. Not enough skill. Yep. Or sorry, not skilled enough. Wow. Cafe I, I think Naka. something like 300 recipes done. Yeah, that sounds about right. It's a lot. Mm-hmm. Oh my gosh, there's an entire, like, catering kitchen sinks without spouts i like it <laughs> oh this is so cool what is this ice cream or uh, noodles 
Ah, okay. This is... The fact that I'm just exploring the kitchen, like... Wow. This is beautiful. What? There's just so much to look at. Like, I don't even have the time to look at it all. I want to, but it's like... Definitely a lot. It's dense. Yeah. Oh, this is cool? Yeah, math is hard. What's up, Josh? He seems like the perfect guy to be working here. Hey. <laughs> Hi. Do you live in town? I do. There's something I can help you with? No, I just moved here. Oh, hey. Welcome to Sunnyside. Thanks. I own the only bar here in town called Never Fret. It's on Main Street. Can't miss it. You should drop <laughs> by sometime. I'm here right now. I will. I am. Thanks. Anytime. Josh Newcomb. Gashapon? Yeah. What are those? Um, they're like gacha machines. We're buying one. Press space <laughs> to turn the knob. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. <laughs> You've received a drone skin. <laughs> oh. Blame Rainy for them being so expensive. We can start this up in a bar. That's not going to get us kicked out at all. All right. Settings. Customize. Skins. We now have options. <laughs> you can't move it around. Uh, Switch camera. There you go. We now know. have a drone designed for the beach. And our acorn. Because that's the charm on top, right? Yeah. So we have a charm the plus beach. the skin. That's a it's a sheep. It's a ram. It's not a beach. I thought that was sand with two seashells. <laughs> it's a ram. <laughs> oh. Well, that's a lovely <laughs> beach sheep we have here. Regardless, skins. That's a cool idea for your drone. And it's gotcha so you can, like, spend in-game money. Only, yes. Only to get new skins. That's cool. You should buy something from the bar. Oh, we just jumped over. Oh my gosh, there's a claw machine. <laughs> there's a claw machine. How can I help you? You can sell stuff here. Eh, why not? <laughs> what do you sell? Oh. Harmonic Hues, Jazzy Jammer, the Solo Sangria, Malty Beer, Rice Beer, Red Wine, a package of roasted peanuts for those bar munchies. Plain <laughs> karaoke. That does not say karaoke. <laughs> karaoke? Yeah. And a vegetable karaoke. That is cool. I should buy something for the bar. Let's get... Let's get the Solo Sangria. That sounds fun. Actually, no. The music's too good to not get a jazzy jammer. I am so irresponsibly spending all my money right now, and I don't care. All right, let's get... The claw machine. Yeah, I know. I got to drink this first. It's good luck. <laughs> Yum, that does like nothing for you. Oh my gosh, we have an arcade and an hour to get home. Today's going to be the day we experience what happens when you pass out. A UFO game three? We're almost bro Oh my gosh. <laughs> what is going on? Oh, they spawned inside of each other. Oh, that's new. Oh, like the front right one? Yeah. It's got a... It's the one behind it, but also green. Mm -hmm. That's new. I've never seen that. Yay! Live bug testing! Yay! Woo! This is so awkward. The music. Uh, space? Hold space to move the claw. Okay. Wow, <laughs> just about as real as real claw machines. <laughs> How many tries do you get? One. One. And I'm broke. Hold on, for the record, Franey, $35? What, are you crazy? It's more than a, a beverage at a bar. 
My drink was seven bucks. I'm paying five damn. times that for, for a claw record, machine. Nothing to do with that. It was originally five. Hashtag blame Rainy. The bar will fund itself. <laughs> this Where is home from here? There's no northeast, southwest, or anything like cardinal directions, so I don't know what ways. That's oh, down. I'm Go assuming towards. Like hit escape. Oh, those settings. Yeah. And then <clears throat> there's an area where you can. North facing uh, minimap enabled. There you go. Aha. I think I might do that. That makes it easier to know what's where. Yeah, we uh, for me at we least. all begged Rainy for it, and so he finally put it in for us, but as an option. <laughs> Thanks, Rainy. <laughs> I take back what I said earlier about the hashtag wing Rainy movement, but <laughs> except in this case, it's blaming you for a good thing. So it's not not as bad. Man, this game is fun. I'm really glad you're having fun. Yeah. And again, we've scratched like not even the surface. We haven't built anything yet. We don't have animals. We haven't harvested anything. We don't have we haven't experienced placing every little item customizedly inside your house to make it perfection. You haven't even been fishing yet. I don't have a fishing rod. Oh. You'll get one. Ah, that's part of the part of the struggle. The Yay. way that I did the tutorial was kind of like letting the game happen to you. Does that make sense? Yeah, like so you like, don't get the fishing tutorial until you do the thing or talk to the person that. Yeah. 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 Not it's hey, not like, so and so wants to talk to you about fishing. Yeah, because we we had it where you have a lot of stuff. But like it was really overwhelming as a player. So like you're getting all this stuff thrown at you very quickly, and it was just yeah. way too much. So we kind of spread it out a little bit. I could see that happening for sure. There's so much stuff. Hold on. <laughs> Hi, outdoor section of Lowe's or Home Depot. <laughs> it's like a nursery. The plant kind. This isn't the farmer's market, is it? No, that waypoint's way far away. This is so cool! Is it an actual nursery? Nope. Oh, yeah. Ladybug's Delight. What's up, Parsa? He is jacked. <laughs> oh, look at that. Put his artwork first. All this shop artwork is so cool. Ladybug's Delight yeah. Garden Center. That's lovely. So the logos for the shops were done by Laura, and then the actual like character art was Kauri. Such talent. Mm -hmm. Irrigation pipes and spikes. Oh my gosh, mm -hmm. we can irrigate our land so we don't have to water. Yep. That's fun. Hanging clay pots. You can plant stuff in these, right? Yep. Different lights, a windmill. Interesting. Oh, a small decorative, decorative yeah. windmill, not an actual. <laughs> I was like, that should be a blueprint, I feel. Organic seeds. A package of homegrown organic basil seeds. I'm curious, are those different than the tomato seeds I'd buy from Sunny Seed? Yep. The organic tomato seeds? Yep. You can be a vegan and only plant organic if you would like to do so. <laughs> that is apparently an option. Nasturium? Nast Nastur Nastertium? Nasturtium? Nastur Nastertium. Nastertium, yes. Yep. English is silly. <laughs> Milkweed. So the sunny seed ones are exactly the same as if I bought them through the sunny seed app. And then organics obviously different. Wow! This is all so... Every shop, by the way, the UI is different, if you haven't noticed that. Like that one, the, the ticket, the item, my cart was in the middle. Other ones, it's been on the right. Others, it's been on the left. Like, it's all different. It's cool. Who are you? Oh, I didn't mean to talk to Parsa. Well, Hi, Parsa. Hi, Parsa. Hi. Comes in, you can like, if they're standing next to each other, you can like aim on who you want to talk to. Ah, okay. 
Great to meet you, dog. Thanks. You too. What brings you to Sunnyside? By the old farm at the entrance of town. Oh, that place Hero was talking about auctioning it off? Yup. Hey, great for you. Welcome to town. Thank you. Anytime. Okay, let's try the aim thing. get closer to him. There you go. It could be because the, the counter is in your way. It works that I'm like walking at him, but then if I... Whatever. Hi, Soda. <laughs> What's up, Pop? Oh, he's not as old. We can't call him Pop. He doesn't look that old. <laughs> he does have some grays, unless that's just highlights. It's gray. Little salt and pepper hair. What's up, yep. Pop? And who might you be? No, I'm not just kidding. Not it's not that, that old. old. I know, I know. <laughs> I'm Doc. I, the, I bought the old farm on the edge of town. Oh, a new, new, a new neighbor then. That's right. And maybe a new customer? Uh, ah, where are my manners? My name is Sota. My wife and I own Ladybug's Delight in town. I think Kay mentioned I could get farming tools from you. You absolutely can. Come by the shop anytime. I'd love to have a new loyal customer. Well, actually, the farm mostly had all the tools I'll need. We sell more than just tools, seeds, plants, garden decorations, and lots more. Do come by and see. I will, thanks. Have a nice day. You too. Uh, there's so many people to meet. In total, how many NPCs do we have here in Sunnyside? Way too many. Yeah? <laughs> um, that you can talk to? Yeah, not just like the filler. Uh, 32. Dang. Yep. That's quite a few. Yep. And you can romance 25 of them. Wow. Assuming they like you back, which is not always going to be the case. But that makes for back. multiple playthroughs. You can yeah. play as different gender identities and get access to different pools of romanceables. Yep. Yay, replayability. <laughs> we love it. And now that the custom one's this removed, it shows too. up anyway. Yeah, I noticed. This used to be just like emptiness. Mm. And now there's actual houses where people live in like apartments and stuff. Yep. Liz did all this. My goodness. Yeah. She went ham. So much to look at. Not nearly enough time for that all right now. <laughs> but. Okay, I think we're going mining now. Is that my de next destination on the mini map? Or the map, period? Uh, uh, it would be this direction. I, yeah. The old caves. Yes, it is. Yep, the old caves. Thank you, sign. These flowers are beautiful. Like, this is so cool. We have sound effects of us that running through was, them. That was all Laura. Dang. It's so pretty. Getting and like, all quilted. yeah, <gasps> let me guess. <laughs> Zen spot. Yup. Oh, that's, this is the kind of stuff that screenshots are made of. It's beautiful. That's so nice. That's so nice. It's fun. It's fun when you find them. Like you're running around. It says sit. And you're like, oh. And oh, yeah. Fun. Just like I have the option to do things here. Yeah. I love that we have a backpack, too. I'm assuming we can change the backpack. No, we thought about it. We might add something later, but it's just the boring brown one for now. Okay. But we can get the pins for our achievements. But the, yes. Yeah, that's fun. Oh, hello. Hi there. Are you the new farmer? I am. Right. Well, good luck with that. Okay, you're full of words. That is Natalie's sister, or Cat's sister, Cat Nat. Yeah. Oh, this is cool. Like a different- yeah, She went ham on the garden. Yeah, they're gorgeous. So pretty. I'm like, not necessary. And this takes us back. <laughs> That's the best part. The unnecessariness of them. It's just done because it's... We can. 
This used to be a hole in the side of a mountain. <laughs> yeah. Like a tiny little cave entrance. It is not that anymore. Like you just have like a little black circle, like right where my head is. And there's other ways of getting here. What does this connect to? Uh, that's this path, Kaida and the shrine. Okay. You'll see why. Oh, this is cool. Okay, my cell signal currently at four bars. I don't know if it's hooked up. I'm gonna be so disappointed if it doesn't go down. I, I don't think it's hooked up right now. <laughs> it, it will eventually, right? Yeah, it's still yeah, four. Yeah, it will be. Okay, they're already splitting off in different directions. I'm gonna venture to say it's not hooked up. I don't think it's hooked up right now. That's okay. I feel bad because I know you were so excited about it. I mean, it's just a tiny little detail that like, you didn't have to add, but it got added, so... Whoa! We have cave sounds now. It's dark! My recommendation is that you put the axe away before you cross the bridge. Yeah. Ah. I don't want you holding it in the cutscene. <laughs> Makes sense. <laughs> Hello, mines. Oh my gosh. The atmosphere. There will be sound on this later. Rumble, 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 crash, crash, <laughs> crash, bang, bang, ah, crash, crash. <laughs> Boom. There you go. Yes. Accurate. We'll talk payment later. <laughs> For my lovely sound effect. Where, oh, I know what this is. <laughs> what? What are you? Spa. Spa. Spark. 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 Spark! Spark? Is that your name? Did you rescue me? I love the sound effects for... It's Matt. Wow. That explains Matt it. Matt did all the, all the VA for Sparky. They're good. I can't believe that happened. But where did you come from? Oh. I see. Well, we should get out of here. No. Oh? Oh, my language systems have updated. Good. You may leave, but I must continue my mission. Whoa. Whoa. Wait, stop. Why? This whole place is probably super unstable after that cave-in. If you mess with the walls, it might make things worse. Oh, you make a sound argument. We should, we should get out of here. You can do whatever your mission is later. A couple days will probably... Days? Whoa! That's pretty. <laughs> the background. Oh, so cavey. I see things I can so mine. <laughs> yeah, it's very cavey. There is no way to know how long I've been inactive. I refuse to wait another second. No, stop. You disagree that this place isn't safe. Oh, you make a sound argument. Again. I know. Now let's get out of here. Ouch. Are you injured? I think so. Are, are you? Whoa. <laughs> That's cool. Hmm. Several of my systems are not working properly. I believe we both need medical aid. Okay. Luckily, I know a doctor. The clinic is probably closed if I was out for a while, and I don't get any service in here. Aha! But we do! I'll give her a call when we're outside. <laughs> service? Yeah, on my phone. Oh, that device in your pocket. Yes, we've met. Hey, what are you doing? Interfacing, of course. Your friend is very interesting. 
primitive by my standards, but impressive for humans. I wonder how long I was caught in the rubble. Year 2020. Hmm, that doesn't mean anything to me. Look, I don't want to be here, be in here anymore. There could be another collapse it or an aftershock. Can we go? Oh, right. Yes. Do you require support? That would help, yeah. Oh no, all the lights have gone out. Not a problem. We got iron, copper, and stone. That's fun. We're getting updates. Takes a village. Yes, it does. Oh, yeah, you've never met Sparky. I haven't. We agreed it was too dangerous. What's wrong with you? Oh, right. Yes. It's late, and I need sleep. It's not late. It's we'll go back later, okay? <laughs> huh? It's supposed to be nighttime. Oh, oh okay. Time. Your argument is sound. Now you go to bed. Oh, it ends the day. <laughs> okay. Yeah. That's cool. This this is good. Oh, I'm excited. This game is going to be so much fun when it's released. <laughs> oh, are you able to talk about when that might be? No. This year. I saw 2024. So yeah, this year for sure. Mm -hmm. Kind of what whatever one you want. I'll feel bad if you can't travel to Higashi after running over here. That's all good. And there's even. Yeah. Parking. It's just a mesh. <laughs> I know, but. We could park our bike and I'm assuming everything like stays time. static in the world. Like if I drive yeah. my, my moped over here, park it, get on a bus, come back, it's still there. If I forget about yep. it for three days, go off in town, it's still here. I come back, grab it. Yep. Cool. But in the when you get the bike, you get a vehicle app and you can summon your vehicle to wherever you're at. Oh, that's that's convenient. Yeah. <gasps> Looks like it's working. Yay. Or we just killed it. That too. <laughs> we'll find out here shortly. Now loading an error screen. We're in. <laughs> Holy. Okay, so it's just mainly the city block here. Yeah, it's just the city square, yeah. And then this is all just kind of... Wow. Because hardware limitations are a thing. Uh-huh. So that's all parked. It can't be accessed. <laughs> and how do we how do we handle this? Invisible wall? Yes. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Just had to find out. This is still giant. Like, we can go all the way it's down big, yeah. till try to get a better view of it. To where there's buildings. Which is like all the way down there. So yeah, that's a lot of Oh, sorry. I should be using the crosswalks. <laughs> yeah, you definitely can't see it from one side to the other. Uh, outside of using a controller to slow your walking, is there a like walk mode? No, it's just the controller. Debonair. Oh my. <laughs> Still need to do like a lighting path. Like, a yeah, this just feels a bit, a bit Dark. moody. Yeah. Yeah, the characters are more lit than the clothing is. We stick out quite a bit. Yeah. <laughs> this is cool though, just like layout wise. Yeah, this was um, this is all Laura or Dalton. Absolutely obsessed with Higashi at night. So, so he stay wants here to for a minute. Understood. Yeah, that looks, looks good at six o'clock. Oh, I voted. <laughs> He's gonna blame me. Cause the idea for Squirrel is that you collect friends like a squirrel collects nuts. That makes sense. Oh, <gasps> we can buy pets, and we have enough for one. You have to have a bed first. Boo. See how it says you have no housing. No housing at farm for this animal. Yep. And they come with names. They're not like randomized. So you can override it if you want. 
Yeah. You can randomize but it too, but you're, you can, but I think it's not working right now. It looks like you can, and I'm sure you'll be yeah, able you to can. eventually, yeah, or rename can. them once you own them or something. But yeah. personality, confident, temperament, calm, anxious. They can have Dog different. Gold. Do they literally have different personality styles? Or is that uh, just like. It, it, it's flavor. <laughs> please select an animal for the bottom row. Bottom two rows. Oh, yeah. Sometimes it bugs out and it doesn't recognize. Bottom it. seven? Weird. No, it's, it's totally random. Okay. Uh, oh, this? actually, wait. Go back. I want to show you something cute. Go back to the fifth. There's a door on the right. And there's another door on the other side. Oh, oh this is adoption center. You can get an idea of which one you want. I would go for this one because it's chill. <laughs> the chill dog. Except if you could interact with something here that would pull up the same exact thing that's in the shop so you know like which one it is. That would be so cool. That would be cool because that's how I would shop. Like, yeah. I like the chill dogs, not the ones that are up on the fence, like barking and. Oh, on the left. <laughs> Rainy's upset that we didn't think about that earlier. <laughs> no, not that one, the other one. I know, not this one. This oh, okay. is where you would play with the, the playroom, yeah. the visiting room. The visiting room. Uh huh. I know, not this one. Oh, Can't even go through that. Uh, yeah, it's symmetrical. Oh, it's all the kitties. This is all Laura. We didn't even plan this. She just did it. It looks so good. It does look so good. This is cool. Yeah, that's fun. Higashi Pet Rescue. There's a simulated garage. That's awesome. <laughs> Obviously not functional. Clearance, in and out signs. This really oh, is pretty. Quick, go to the noodle shop. Nudes! <laughs> Nudes! I think it's down that, that alley. Oh my gosh, this is cool. It's called this Got is Nudes. Like, favorite part of the entire game is this alley. Last one on the right, looks like. Yep. This it? Yep. Japanese like soul that. food. Oh my gosh. Got news. <laughs> tofu soba. Misu udon, tofu udon, curry udon. Tonkotsu ramen, beef ramen. My goodness. Let's get some beef ramen. <laughs> because we have to. Watch what happens when you eat it. Uh, we need to do it this way, right? Yep. Dang. I, sorry, I thought you were talking like animation or something. I was staring no, at no, that. No, no. It's one yeah, of the few that hunger bar went from nothing to full. Yeah, it's one of the few. So all the food, it doesn't give you like points. It gives you like percentage fill on your bar. Ah, and okay. So That's 100%. Yeah, the ramen's the only one. Dang, this is cool. That's fine. I'm looking forward to that. Oh, there it is. 15 minutes before. Yeah, I've been complaining about that. Yeah, that's odd. Rene says, I really just wanted the alleyway. Let's be honest. Oh my gosh. He's like, the alleyway, the alleyway. I'm like, okay. <laughs> All right. I need to go eat food. It's almost 9 p.m. and I haven't food had dinner. Food is important. It is. Well, I'm glad you had fun. Yeah, me and too. Thanks for playing so long. This is, yeah. Uh huh. Thank you for letting me. This is incredible. <laughs> yeah, I'm so excited. Thank you, thank you for playing. It was, hey, it was there a lot he of fun. is. Yeah, I switched. I switched over to the Discord app. 
I see. Um, you know, it was it was really fun to watch you play, and I'm really glad you went to Higashi. The the cool thing about all of these locations is that they're all hangout spots too. So obviously, like you can go to the noodle shop and just buy noodles and eat and eat it. Uh, but when you unlock hangouts, you can hang like you can invite people to it, and depending on like time of day or what activity you choose, you can have like different cutscenes there. And the cool thing is, depending on what point of the story you're at, you can get extra like story. Um, so you can like you can do it at the noodle shop. Somebody else can get the same cutscene at the cafe, um, and that's what really brings all the locations together. That's cool. Yeah, but yeah, thank you for playing as well. So it was really, much, really excited like, that you enjoyed it so much. Yeah, you this is for, fun. You played for what, two and a half, three hours? But there's still so much for you I, to discover. That's, like, that was you closer even, to four. Yeah, you didn't even scratch yeah. the surface of like all the different stuff. That oh, no, not at all. We didn't get animals. We haven't really done any building. I remember last time yeah. trying to build, like, yeah, you build your house, but then you build all your cabinets inside, and then you place your appliances on top of the cabinets. Yep wherever you want like grid yeah. or no grid there's a reason you could turn the grid off like yeah we actually recently i made a it's still a reversible choice but i made a choice of disabling some annoying collisions and allowing you to clip yeah. some stuff inside of each other yes for the sake please of freedom, freedom because you i know like everybody it. does that in sims anyway yeah like why not why not, why not just allow you to do it's that not pretty that it's is a lovely sun sometimes it's beautiful you can't even see any town because the range isn't allowing it, but <laughs> yeah, it's, it's so beautiful. Like <laughs> so screenshot worthy. But it's been, it's been three years since you covered Sunnyside for the first time on YouTube. So. Yeah, I know. And it looks it's been a, a lot different than it used to Yeah, <laughs> in a good way. I, I mean, when you first um, covered it, we were still on like, you were using uh, an app Vroid for the... models. Yes, v, -Roid. v -Roid. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, so much better. And it looked great then. And like <laughs> stock I'm assets thinking. for your cows and stuff. And I'm trying to think if there's anything in this that is still the same or asset-wise the same as it was. But I, I'm really struggling to... I the think phone. It... The phone. The phone. But you've, the phone I mean, model. Even the phone, the phone looks phone different. Model like ten times. Yeah, yeah it looks different. It constantly. Every time a new iPhone releases, he fixes it. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, That's funny. Allow like <laughs> gotta make it modern. <laughs> yeah. Man, uh, well, thank you guys so much for letting me do this. This has been awesome. I'm so excited to get my hands on more of this and play like I'm gonna continue it. Soon. Soon. Yeah. Soon. I know. This year, at some point. Yeah, yeah. But yeah, thank you. Thank you for playing. It was, it was so much fun. Of course. It's you. hard to put down, but my stomach is yelling at me, so. Yeah, yeah. Food's yeah. important. Enjoy your mm -hmm. food. And yeah, thank you. Well, thank you, guys. I appreciate it. Best of luck with the rest of development. It's coming along great. Yeah, thank you. Appreciate it. Of course. Take care. Bye. Bye. If you're still here with me after that and are wanting more, I actually had the privilege of recording with Fem and Rainy, not just for any reason, but for the intent of being featured on their store page on Steam as one of those now broadcasting videos. So if you have any interest in seeing any more of that four hour playthrough, head on over to their Steam page and check it out. And while you're there, feel free to drop them a wish list. It really does help them out. Thanks so much, everyone, and I apologize for my absence recently. I started dating again after over eight years of not doing so, and I have a new girlfriend who I just celebrated our six-month anniversary with last week. It's incredibly exciting, and while things have been great, my free time has obviously diminished significantly, but I'm hoping to get much more of that back towards the end of the summer, at which time my plan is to get back to a little bit more regular uploads. But with that, I hope you enjoyed, and I hope you have a wonderful time playing Sunnyside if you choose to do so yourself. Thanks again so much for watching, but until next time, as always, take care. <laughs>